Abbott Elementary star Tyler James Williams addresses his sexuality and explains why he thinks speculation about anyone's personal life is, in his words, dangerous. The star shares a statement to social media responding to rumors surrounding his sexuality. Tyler James notes the conversation is part of the much broader context of outing someone before an individual is ready. He says in a post to his Instagram stories, I'm not gay, but I think the culture of trying to find some kind of hidden trait or behavior that a closeted person lets slip is very dangerous. Williams adds, overanalyzing someone's behavior in an attempt to catch them directly contributes to the anxiety a lot of queer and queer questioning people feel when they fear living in their truth. It makes the most pedestrian of conversations and interactions in spaces feel less safe for our gay brothers and sisters and those who may be questioning. The actor goes on to say he feels the idea plays into, quote, an archetype many straight men have to live under that is oftentimes unrealistic, less free, and limits individual expression. In his message, he reiterates that speculating about anyone's personal life is a very slippery slope. He says being straight doesn't look one way, being gay doesn't look one way, and what may seem like harmless fun and conversation may actually be sending a dangerous message to those struggling with real issues. I refuse to inadvertently contribute to that message. William's statement is notably made at the start of Pride Month, and he reaches out to the LGBTQIA community, calling himself an ally and saying, Happy Pride to all of my queer and questioning brothers, sisters, and individuals. I pray that you feel seen in ways that make you feel safe in the celebration that is this month. Tyler James, who longtime fans remember as a child star on the hit series Everybody Hates Chris, recently spoke about his own career path and the importance of finding a safe space for himself as an adult during an appearance on THR's Comedy Actors Roundtable. What I loved with this period of time is that I knew what I was doing. It wasn't as much the like, the the creative of it all it was handling the success i guess the like the 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 press and all of that i felt much more grounded and knew like how to set boundaries and when to like tap out and you know um knew what i wanted to say and the type of actor i wanted to be i think before as a kid you're just trying to make people happy Mm -hmm. you know you just kind of want to do a good job so it was good to be able to get another run at that Mm -hmm. now